Hey guys, Brand Fight Gaps here. In today's tutorial, I'll be showing you how to put animation or uh, OpenGL ES on your iPhone. So let's just get started. The first thing you need is to download SIO2. So let's just go on the internet and type in SIO2. This will also be in the description of this video, so go check it out. So it's the first one on Google if you just Google SIO2, and it'll link you to this website. Uh, let's just go on the download tab. And they also have this for Windows so if you want to do this, and it has, and they have all these sample codes that are like a hundred, hundred, hundred fifty dollars, and you can, it, it's like full flexibility of basically what the iPhone, it's just basically it. So just scroll down all the way um, until you get here, and you want to click the little I agree and read this if you want, uh, and download the SI2, SIO2 free edition, which they're both the exact same, but this one has like a certificate stuff and you don't have to do other certificate stuff so just download that it's a fairly small file um, once you download it you'll get this folder and you'll have like the exporter and the documents and you have these uh, sample tutorials which we'll be using so this connects with blender so we'll just go into blender and we'll just do some basic stuff if you watch my other tutorial uh, I show you how to use the basics of blender so go back and watch that so here you are, I uh, got your queue, let's just delete that and press space, mesh, let's just do a plane press in, just make this 10 and that one 10 alright and now let's add a monkey face again like we did last time monkey go up like last time let's just make this smooth and we're gonna rotate it so it's facing us. Alright, so now uh, once we have this, our view basically all set up, um, we are going to want to make our camera uh, focus like that. So you want to select it by left clicking the camera and press Shift F and you should get this little view. And so you should be in it and by controlling it, you do the W, A, S, and D. So it's like a video game and move your mouse around. So you want to just press it forward and move it around. And say like the view and back up, so um, and that should be good. So just press O again to escape, or if that's O, then escape. That's fine. I guess right there. Oh wait, no. Press O. Sorry about that. O, and then press Shift F. There. Now we're in it. And now you want to press W and get in it and move around to however you like it. It's like a car backing up and stuff. So that should be good for me. Maybe up a little. There we are. Alright, so press O again to escape it, and there our camera's all lined up. So now we're going to draw on it. So let's just click, left click the monkey and do vert sculpt, uh, vertex paint. Sorry. And this time we're just going to add brownish, I guess. Brown, oh, it's red. In between the red and yellow, so there's brown, I guess. And make a all brown and stuff all right so there you are um, let's just add a little black like we did last time ears I guess and let's add some red to its eyes like we did last time as well all right so looks all right whatever um, now I'm gonna go back to object mode left click on the the um, the plane and go to vertex paints again and like last video let's just do red you want to brush outward of the corners and let's just do purple that's kind of coolish I guess and on the back let's just do yellow so it's like that press zero and that's what's gonna look like so then press zero again to, all right so now we're good with that. Uh, let's export this. This is like a confusing method, but you'll eventually get the hang of it. So let's just go back to the object mode. And in this top panel up here, you want to click down and go to scripting. So you should get this little thing, and you want to do uh, text open. And here's your uh, basically like an opener. And so you want to find where you downloaded it. And there's SIO2 uh, under thing, uh, SDK. So click on that. Want to click on exporter 
and then you want to click on this si2 exporter.py click on that and open text file now you want to right right click and then execute execute script and you should get this thing now you want to click the little dot dot thing and just tell it where to save it desktop is fine for me and export it so now it is exported exit out right now and there's our little script that we need right there that's what you should have and that's what it should look like so let's just call it uh, face so why not just face alright so anyways now you want to go back into your SI, SIO2 uh, project folder that you downloaded and let's just pick a folder I, these are all example projects I don't have time to actually go through the code and stuff and it's really confusing so let's just choose number 10 tutorial number 10 clean it up and open up Xcode and Xcode this is the new Xcode this is the uh, I think the 4 uh, 4.0 beta seed I think that's the final one so that's my current version this might take a little while to load up All right, there it is so now you, what you want to do is go into drag this little thing that you created and drag it into there and click add so now once it's in there uh, go into classes or no other sources sorry about that and uh, close that go into template.mm and there should be a little tutorial 09 it depends what project you have but just delete that and call it whatever you want to and this might not work it depends on what code I'm not sure and this is gonna uh, do different stuff with the camera as you can tell and cube and plane and all that stuff. it's not really built for our project but that's just how you import it and so this is gonna take a while to uh, build and stuff because there's lots and lots of stuff as you see the bullet has lots of stuff PNG all this stuff has lots of stuff so I'm just going to change it to um, work with the 4.0 so I'm going to build and 4.0 exit out and simulator so this is going to take quite a lot quite a while to build it because it's for the first time so I'm just going to pause it and when it's done I'll come back to you it actually takes like two minutes it's quite a long time so I'll pause it and come right back to you when when um, it's done so all right, so I'm back and it is uh, installing on your f on my phone and this actually took about five minutes I think because it was a big file and this actually really is not working for uh, this uh, specific uh, project right here because you see I got these 133 warnings because it does not uh, have cube and plan I did not name it that so um, this is completely wrong I'm not sure if they'll even work right here it took a long time to uh, build and load it might actually work I'm not sure we'll see so yeah we'll just wait here and see and it takes a long time to load I mean it has all these files in it to make it 3d which is pretty good because you don't really have to put any code in but if you actually want some actions to work you actually have to do so that's pretty good so yeah it did not work right there because I don't have half the things I did not name so I'll just exit out so that's basically a tutorial how to put it in there um, I'm sure if you if you actually like know how to uh, do this and putting all the code in the master at it that would um, that would be great but uh, then also um, if you're really interested in this stuff and you like this kind of stuff and you want to learn actually how to um, put 3d stuff and models and animations and how to do all that stuff in here uh, please comment below and saying because if you don't I'll just delete all these and stuff like that but if you guys are really interested I have a book on the website and it's like right next to me actually right now uh, and uh, I'll show it to you real fast and uh, it's a pretty helpful book it has lots of stuff in it um, that will help you with the code and animations and stuff yeah this is the book right there I have this book right next to me and I might do a giveaway if you guys are really into this stuff but um yeah I might give away the have right here um, so check it out uh, if you don't like this please comment below because I'll delete these those two videos but if you do um, that's great I'll keep on making them so that's about it thanks for uh, thanks for watching and I'll guys see you next time oh yeah and also I have this other software that makes it for free it's unity iPhone you can google it and look up look it up I might make another video on it depends how much you like this one this one actually involves no code it does it all for you it's pretty 
you need. So if you want to see Unity,